Hey everyone, this is MC Barber here. We have a nice makeover here for you. This kid has a really nice hair, but he decided to remove it and to go to something easier for him because he plays sports and the hair is on his way. So he wants to uh, get something easier to maintain. So we're gonna hear, we're gonna go here uh, from long hair into a nice classic haircut with a touch with a modern touch uh, we're gonna uh, leave the top slightly longer and we're gonna cut the sides short with a nice taper back so first thing here is to remove the bulk just to get it out of the way then i'm using my uh, standard one and a half uh, bulk removal uh, and uh, we're gonna create the foundation for the haircut as well so here, as you can see, I always start from the back. I had a question the other day on the social media, why do I always start from the back? Uh, the reason I start from the back, it's easier for me to balance the side once I do the back. Uh, so, so once I do the back, I can just go from there uh, to the sides and I can see that balance and it's, you know, even height and so on and so forth. Uh, so here, uh, I really, I'm just going uh, um, pretty much uh, hard, just removing the bulk of the hair. The top is going to stay slightly disconnected on both sides. That way he can create a style. He can push it uh, straight back or slightly uh, to the side and then back. That's how we're going to style it at the end. Uh, but uh, in general, uh, I like using uh, heavy-duty clippers. Uh, the way they cut is cleaner than the, the clippers with the plastic guards. They leave the lines uh, uh, on, on, the, on the head when you cut short like this. The heavy-duty clippers cut clean uh, and they do a good job. They are heavy duty, so no matter how heavy the hair is or thick, they, they easily go through. Once that is done, I remove the bulk and also I created a foundation for the hairstyle. Now here I'm gonna shape him up slightly. Uh, I'm not gonna really push him to, see, to his hairline. I'm just gonna kind of clean it so it looks nice and clean. The edger here I'm using is the the new cordless uh, the new cordless uh, Andy's uh, edger. Uh, I believe it's called T Outliner. Uh, it's actually a very good edger. However, it does get hot fast, and I think that's because the the, the, the it's a pretty strong motor in it, and the teeth are so fine. I'm going to try to actually change it uh, into ceramic uh, blade uh, and hopefully it will stay uh, uh, cooler a little longer. Now here with a straight edge razor just kind of clean up to the line. I don't want to really get too deep in his line. you know. Now these haircuts I usually don't plan. Uh, I do the haircuts as I see the client when he walks in and he has a nice hair for a video, that's what I do. So uh, these are all like 20 minutes haircuts and I, I cut it, kind of cut them down to 10 minutes. But usually it takes me 20 minutes to do this haircut. So here I started from zero just on the taper on the temple and the back area here on nape. And then uh, just the taper. But they, uh, fading this is slight, uh, I mean, uh, quite an easy task. Basically, I start from zero, and then if you want to fade from bottom, bottom up, you can uh, just start with half and one, and then, you know, open your blade because it's already one and a half there. Or you can reverse the process, start with, uh, one, with the open, one with open blade, close the blade, half open blade, close blade, and then just remove uh, the guards and just go with the open blade and keep closing the blade until you reach zero. So it's pretty simple really. But here actually now I'm fading from top down. As you can see I went with one which was red. Now I'm going with a uh, half 
and then I'll remove the guard and just, re you know, there you go. And now I'm gonna just kind of fade this into zero. My zero, my clippers are zero gap, so it's easy to remove that line between the uh, edger and my clipper, fading clipper. Sometimes you have to go back and kind of touch up if you see something that you don't like. And that's quite common. Now here uh, I am uh, doing some uh, scissor over knuckles and scissor over comb. Uh, this is almost like three uh, lengths haircut. You have uh, sides uh, that is one and a half and tapered on the bottom. Then this area that I'm cutting right now, it's quite longer. Uh, and then uh, the top is very long. So when he pushes it back, it, sometimes it can almost blend. It looks like, uh, almost like connected. It looks really nice. Uh, but it's quite disconnected haircut, as you will see. I am uh, cutting the top with a straight edge razor. Uh, the reason I like to cut with a straight edge razor is to create a volume. Especially when the top is longer, it gives you that, uh, you know, volume, uh, makes the hair uh, looking healthy and full as you are creating the layers inside, the, inside of the hair. Uh, razor cutting is, I love razor cutting, really. Uh, I do at least 25% of my work is razor cutting and 25 uh, I would say is scissor work and then the rest of it is clipper work since most of the haircuts today are really fades so then most of the haircut involves uh, clippers obviously the top we're gonna leave the front we're gonna leave longer but when you get towards the front you don't want to cut the same way you want to cut from inside that way you don't lose you, you don't create short hairs that will stick out in the hairline so you cut from inside and we'll leave that quite longer uh, one news is that I am opening a barber academy um, and I, my website will be uh, ready by the end of the year so you can register on my website or at least submit your information uh, in my system, MC Barber system, we have uh, clipper company, scissor, clipper category, scissor category, razor category, and blow drying and styling. Uh, and uh, it really, you will learn the fundamentals and advanced techniques. As you can see, the haircut actually is looking quite beautiful. Uh, it blends nice and it will be a lot easier for this gentleman to take care. Uh, I have a seminar coming in May. I believe it's May 23rd or something is on my website. It's only eight people. Uh, the, the, there is only six spots left. Uh, if you are interested in my seminar, it's an eight hour hands-on seminar. Uh, sign up now, don't wait, because I think it's gonna be sold uh, soon. So if you like to attend my seminar, Sign up now to my website. Uh, here is your before and after. Long hair. And now uh, you have nice, uh, short, easy to maintain hairstyle. Guys, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate uh, if you haven't signed up. I mean, uh, subscribe, please subscribe. As you can see, the back looks really nice. The sides look great. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the button up, like, if you like my work. Uh, I really appreciate if you sign up. Uh, it makes me motivated to, mo to make more videos. Thank you. Until next time, take care of yourself.